guys, my name is Cam and welcome back to my YouTube channel. So as you can see, we're going to be unboxing three copies of Stray Kids' newest album, Go Live, and all of them are gonna be the limited version. I'm filming from this angle since it's much closer and I'm able to sit down. And I'm sorry for any background noise that you might hear since my window is open, but I'm going to stop rambling and open up these albums. So here's the cover of the album. It just has their names on the side, Stray Kids on the top, and then the first album on the side. And I really like all the holographic effects that they have on here. Here's the spine and the back. And I know that all the spines connect when you have the two regular versions. I'm not really sure where all the goodies are, so I'll just take them out really fast. Okay, so I've taken out all the goodies and now let's just take a look at the photo book and CD. So here's the CD, it's just a basic black disc with just the title and then some nice holographic effects. I'm not really sure why it's not focusing, but you get the idea. Now we'll just do a quick flip through of the photo book. So I think this is one of the first times that they didn't do like a random member first page, which was really surprising to me. And by the way, I do collect Bang Chan since he is my ultimate male bias, so I'm hoping for a few cards of him. I think this was definitely either Changbin or Felix's era. I think Changbin's rapping just really suited the concept of this song. And same with Felix, his voice just really suited the lines that he got. And I'm really surprised that he got a lot of lines since normally, He's one of the members that doesn't get as many lines. And then we have Hyunjin with his iconic long hair this era. Hyunjin also really shined this era, but honestly, every era is Hyunjin era, so... Did I lie? Did I lie? Did I lie? As for this album, I think this is probably one of my favorite Stray Kids albums. I think the only one that I like more is I'm Who, which is the one that has my pace. The variety on this album is really amazing, and if you haven't listened to it, I really recommend that you do. Same with I Am Who, I think that all of the tracks are really, really solid, and all of them could deserve to be a title track. But I've been watching all of these stages of God's Menu, and I have to say that their vocals, their stability is freaking amazing. The dances look so hard, yet they sound exactly like the studio version, which is something that really amazes me since most groups don't really do that on all the music shows, especially on M Countdown. I think the only groups that I know of that sing live on there are Itzy and Stray Kids. <laughs> But I really, really admire Stray Kids not lip syncing like at all. Even at their concert, which I went to in February, I don't think they lip synced in any of their songs, which was really impressive. Here are the credits. And yeah, that's basically the end of the photo book. Now I'll take out the photo cards, lyric book, and film strip one by one. So here's the lyric book, and I got Changbin, Hyunjin, Seungmin, and Jongin's unit. It's really cool. Hopefully I get both versions since I did get three albums. But yeah, it's basically the same as the lyric part for the photo book. Next is this, which I think is a poster. And it is... I'll probably hang this up in my room somewhere. I'm kind of running out of wall space for these K-pop posters, but here's the poster. Next is the standee, and we got Seungmin. Seungmin is pretty high on my bias list in Stray Kids. I think he's a really great main vocalist, and he really stepped up to the plate this era. So yeah, there's that. Next is the pre-order Polaroid, and we got Felix. I can't really read Korean, but here's his Polaroid. I really, really like it when groups do Polaroid style photo cards or postcards in their albums since I think they look really, really cute. But there's that. Next is the film strip and <gasps> we got Chan and Seungmin's unit. So definitely gonna be keeping this one. 
And now we have our first photo. Oh, this isn't a photo card. It's, I think it's the message photo card that goes with the crossword puzzle. Um, that was kind of a fail, but let's look at the next card. Oh, is this a real one? <gasps> we got Hyunjin. Oh my God, this card is so cute. Why isn't it focusing? There we go. So we got Hyunjin's photo card. I'm not really sure the different versions, but this has a white back. I think the limited one has like holographic stuff on the sides. Then we have this card. Oh, that's not a card. Stop fooling me. Literally these message cards, but oh, what does it say? March 25th, you make sure you could stay. So this is just their debut date and then their iconic phrase. Next we have this card and this is the limited one. Oh my God. Oh, we got Ji Sungi. Oh my God. This card is literally so cute. Oh my God. If I have to trade this off, I'm going to be kind of sad, but we got Ji Sung for the limited version photo card. And I really like that JYP stopped doing those ugly ass border cards. And they replaced it with the signature backs and then the message backs. But yeah, we pulled Jisung and this card is so freaking cute. So here's the last card. I think this is the double-sided one. Oh no, it's not. <gasps> we got Jisung again. Oh my God. I feel like I'm Jisung blessed since I pulled like two or three of his photo cards with the Levanter albums. And then I think I pulled a full Jisung set in my I'm Who album. So yeah, we got Jisung and Hyunjin for the photo cards. And now I'll just quickly open up the last two albums. Hopefully they aren't the same polls. I already see the red and I'm thinking that it's Seungmin. <gasps> oh, it's not. Oh, it is. So we got Seungmin again for the standee. Hopefully these aren't all dupes. Oh God. Oh no. <laughs> and we got the same unit for the lyric book. And then for the photo cards, uh-oh. These are all gonna be the same, aren't they? Oh, they're not. We got Jisung for the Polaroid. What did I say? Jisung loves me. So we got a new Jisung Polaroid. I already see this one being the same. And it's the Hyunjin photo card. Oh, this one's different. We got Hyunjin for this one. Oh, this is the double-sided one. So we got Hyunjin for the double-sided version. I'm not really sure how these ones work, but Hyunjin's also blessing me with these gorgeous photo cards. And then we have the same Jisung card for the limited one. And then here's the message card. And then the same film strip. So I'll probably end up trading this to any other unit. And now we have our last, shut up birds. We have our last album and hopefully there aren't too many dupes. I'm kind of scared, but let's just open it up. Damn it. <laughs> okay, I think this is gonna be Seungmin. And it is. So we got another dupe Seungmin. Um, ideally, I'd like to trade it for Bang Chans. So DM me on Instagram at Zimzalabin if you'd like to trade. The lyric book is the same, no surprise there. And now for the photo cards and goodies, we got another Jisung Polaroid. The same Jisung Limited photo card. And the same Hyunjin set, right? Yeah. And the same Hyunjin set. So I think all of these are going to be up for a trade to any Cham photo cards that I need, limited to limited, etc., etc. But yeah, so it's pretty much all the same photo cards. But let me just sort everything out really quickly and let's get into the outro. So for a recap of my polls, we got three Sunmin standees, two Jisung, and one Felix Polaroid, three of the Sunmin and Chan film strips. Three Jisung Limited photo cards, one of this Jisung photo card, three of this Hyunjin photo card, and then two of this double sided Hyunjin photo card. I've probably already posted a want to trade post on Instagram, but you should definitely go follow me at Simzalabe. Oh, 
Overall, I'm kind of sad that we got a bunch of dupes, but I'm overall pretty happy about my pulls. But I think it's good to see all the dupes so you know that these places like Target, they don't really shuffle the album. So if you buy multiple, you're probably going to get a lot of dupes. But yeah, that's pretty much the end of this unboxing. Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you in my next video. Peace.